Okay, welcome back guys. So we have another question in today's video and we have 5 over x times 5 over x is equal to x over 5 and we need to figure out the value of the x. So what we have on the left side of the equation is basically 5 times 5 divided by x times x and on the other side we have x over 5. So what we get in here is 5 times 5 is 25 and x times x is x squared is equal to x over 5. And we know in here we have these two. So we have the multiplication of these two which is x squared times x is equal to multiplication of the other two which is basically 25, which is 5 squared times 5. Now what we have is x cubed is equal to 5 cubed. So we're going to subtract 5 cubed on each side. So we have x cubed minus 5 cubed is equal to 0. And now we have the difference of cubes which will be a minus b times a squared plus a b plus b squared. So we're going to use this formula in here. We have a minus b, which is x minus 5 times x squared plus ab, which is 5x plus 5 squared, which is 25 is equal to 0. Now we have our a times b equals 0. That means a can be 0 or b can be 0. So if we do x minus 5 is equal to 0, our x will be 5. And that would be one answer for this question. And we have x squared plus 5x plus 25 is equal to 0. And we have a quadratic formula where our a is 1. We have b is equal to 5. And we have our c, 25. So if we do our quadratic formula, we have x equal to minus b plus or minus the square root of the discriminant, which is b squared minus 4 times a times c divided by 2a. So we have minus 5 plus or minus the square root of b squared. So 5 squared, 25 minus 4 times a is 1 and c is 25 divided by 2. So what we have for x is minus 5 plus or minus we have 25 minus 100 because 4 times 25 is 100 so minus 75 over 2 and our discriminant is negative which means we have complex answers. So minus 5 plus or minus 4 75 we can do 25 times 3 and minus 1 would be i squared or our imaginary number divided by 2 we can take out these two from the square root so our x uh, which will be minus 5 plus or minus 5i square root of 3 divided by 2 or we can write it minus 5 divided by 2 plus or minus 5i square root of 3 divided by 2. And that would be our complex answer for uh, this question. Let me know if you guys have a better solution to solve this one. I'd be happy to discuss it in the comment section. You guys take care and I'll see you in the next video. Have a good one.